Hey, what's up guys? It's Slim McCall here. I apologize, it's been a little while since I pushed out a video to you all. However, that's changing today because we are going to the Heidelberg Castle. Now, I haven't actually been here before, but there's a place called Heidelberg City that's about an hour and a half from the Ramstein slash Kaiserslautern area. And there's a ton of history, there's a ton of sightseeing to go do and go see. So, let's go check it out. All right, so like I said, guys, I've never actually been to the Heidelberg Castle. I've only drove, driven by, so I don't actually know if it's gonna be open because it is a Sunday today, and most of the time, um, all German stores and attractions are shut down on Sunday. So I couldn't find a lot of information on it, so I'm gonna at least go there, check it out, try to take some photos and whatnot. And if all else fails, we're gonna go to some other places and check them out for you guys. So here we go. Sorry guys, I had to stop at the BX and drop off this coffee machine. It crapped out on me and I was just gonna return it. That was the second unit I had and I just said screw it. Huh? Anyways, we are on the Autobahn on our way to the Heidelberg Castle right now. So it's right at an hour and a half from Ramstein. Um, you can cut that time in almost in half um, because it's Autobahn the whole way there and you can you know, go as fast as you want. So, I'm expecting to get there in about an hour, hour and 15 minutes, um, we'll see. So, driving here in Germany is a love-hate relationship. The things I love would be the Autobahn, for example. What I really like about the Autobahn is the actual, like, interacting with the driver's part. You see, in the States, you know, you're not really supposed to drive in the left-hand side of the interstate. However, you know, a-holes do it anyways because, you know, everybody thinks that they're in a hurry. Everybody wants to get there really quick, you know, this and that. And for Germans, that's a little different. They highly prioritize, you know, do I really need to be in that left lane driving that fast? So, whenever you're in the left lane, you're usually hauling the mail. I mean, you'll be going over 130 clicks all the way up to 200 sometimes. And which, for example, would be anywhere between 90 and 120 miles an hour. So, I mean, the left lane is definitely for people that's really trying to get somewhere quick. And anytime that I'm about to get in the left lane, I double check my mirror twice because I want to make sure I'm not about to merge into someone who's hauling butt. So, Whenever they're driving, if there's somebody in the left lane that you're approaching, they will move over into the right. And it's just that simple. If you're going faster than that person, you move over. You know, there's none of that racing and this and that here. You just move over. And if you're trying to pass someone else, you can get back in the left-hand lane and get back in the right-hand side. It's just, it's that simple. And people in America just really, really, really struggle with that. They don't understand that hey, this person is really trying to get somewhere, just let him go. All right guys, so an hour and 10 minutes later, I finally make it over to the Heidelberg Castle. The landscape here is absolutely beautiful. Tons of trees, and there's even dungeons here at the side as well. So as you can see, there is actually a piece of the castle that fell off many years ago and that was really neat to look at. And here is the entrance to the main courtyard and it is here that you get the best view of the castle. This place is just magnificent. And here along the edge, you can actually see how far down it actually goes. And here you get the most magnificent view of the river and all the bridges and stuff going through Heidelberg City and it's just a beautiful sight to see. All the creativity and artwork that went into this castle is just absolutely phenomenal. Oh my gosh, that castle was absolutely wonderful. Definitely gonna be doing a photo shoot there soon. 
All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and make the hike back up to my car so we can go check out the rest of Heidelberg City and whatnot. All right. Well, that was a good trip. Looking at the Heidelberg Castle. I can definitely tell you that I will be making my way out there to do a photo shoot that place just has so much history and so much culture in there it's just it, it was an amazing place to go visit so now we still have a little bit of daylight left so i'm gonna go drive around a little bit in Heidelberg and show you guys some footage of just like the local area and whatnot so here we go It's a bummer the sun went away. However, that did not take away from the beauty of the Heidelberg city. There's just so much life and so much just joy going on inside of here. I just, I could not get enough of all the beautiful lights and the people walking around. I just, it was an absolute wonderful trip to take that was within a two hour drive. Tell me these cities like are not cool because there's just there's so much like culture and just so much different stuff to do here. So I, I love the feeling. Oh look at this statue. He's got a serious mustache. Alright, so I hope you guys enjoyed that Heidelberg Castle trip that I just took. Um, I plan to make some more videos um, like that. I hope you guys enjoyed it because I want to make a video of Frankfurt, Mannheim and of course Kaiserslautern and all the other areas that are within a one, two hour drive. So if you guys like this video, be sure to give it a thumbs up and please subscribe. Um, this is my new channel. I'm trying to push out some videos for you guys and the more um, people subscribe and like my work, the more content I'm gonna push out for you guys. So as always, I'm Liam McCall.